Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today's video is going to be my December favorites for the month of December. When you see this video, it's going to be New Year. So I want to wish everybody a very happy New Year. I I hope that your um, 2019 brings you nothing but joy, happiness, success, peace, just everything good in the New Year coming up. And I cannot wait to see what 2019 brings for everybody and my friends and my family and everybody that I care and love about. So um, let's get on to my December favorites. So I'm going to start off with makeup items that I love for the month of December. The first thing that I wanted to talk about for December that I have been loving are these brushes right here. These are the ColourPop brushes. These brushes are so life-changing. If you don't have these brushes, I recommend you go out and purchase them. They're very affordable. They're like $6 or $8 each. Um, so it's just very affordable compared to some brushes out there that are like $10, $15 each. So, and these brushes are very high quality. They do not shed. They blend out your eyeshadows beautifully and effortlessly. I, they're actually all like dirty because I used them on a previous uh, video that I did so and I honestly cannot imagine my makeup routine without these brushes I use these brushes almost every single time I do my makeup except for today because they're dirty I didn't use them for my makeup I used other brushes but my I feel like my eye look didn't come out as nice as it usually does because I didn't use these brushes uh, I have the eye brushes I have this brush right here I actually use this today to blend out my concealer and to set my concealer today underneath my eyes and the rest of my face. And I actually use this brush as well because I bronzed my skin. And this brush, I love that this brush gets into like the hollows of your cheeks. I love this brush for bronzing and contouring. I use this brush for highlighting. And then I didn't use this brush, but I usually just use this brush because I didn't put blush today but anyways the whole thing is that these brushes are amazing and if you don't have these brushes go out and purchase them like since I was doing brushes I might as well tell you guys about this sponge right here this is the morphe um, sponge I don't, I don't really remember the full name for it this is the morphe sponge right here I have been loving this sponge in the month of December I have been using only this sponge I haven't used any other sponges um, and you know, the funny thing is, is I don't miss my beauty blender. I really don't. Like, I remember when beauty blender was such a big thing. It was very popular. I honestly haven't used my beauty blender in a very long time. I've been using this sponge. I also have, let me show you guys what I have. I have this sponge too by Equal Tools. Sorry, my sponges are dirty. I also have this sponge by Equal Tools. And I have the little mini one too. But I've been noticing that I really love sponges that are this shape like this shape right here um, because I feel like when you're trying to blend underneath your eyes when you're trying to blend like in certain parts of your face I feel like this part of the sponge really really helps you to get underneath there and if you compare this to my beauty blender like this is just like egg shape which is fine but I just feel like I've been gravitating more towards these sponges so for the month of December I've only been using this sponge every time I've been like applying foundation or concealer. Since I was just talking about concealers, I want to show you guys the concealer I have been loving for the month of December. This is the Wet n Wild Photo Focus Concealer. I love, love, love this concealer. Like I have not been able to put this concealer down ever since I purchased, purchased it. Um, I use this concealer almost every single time I do my makeup. I love this concealer. I love the consistency of it. I love the effect it gives me. It gives me such a flawless look underneath my eyes. It doesn't look cakey. It doesn't look powdery. It looks so smooth and so creamy and so nice. So I just feel like this concealer works so well and it's very affordable. And usually if you go to Walgreens or CVS, they usually have sales. Sometimes it's 50% off, sometimes it's 25% off, sometimes it's like, like buy three, get twenty. $10 off so this concealer is so affordable and it's so great and honestly I think it's probably one of the best concealers I have in my collection and I have quite a few concealers in my collection I have like about 10 concealers and this is one of my top three concealers in my collection. And now on to foundation. I have been loving this foundation right here. This is the CoverGirl True Matte True 
Tarte. This is the CoverGirl True Blend Matte Made Foundation. This is my perfect shade. I wear the shade D40 and I love how CoverGirl now is um, cruelty free. That is a big thing for me and that's an amazing thing for me. And I also love how this foundation doesn't look it's not like a cakey matte type of foundation. I feel like it sinks into my skin and I feel like it just gives me such a nice coverage and nice natural finish. It's a matte foundation, but it's not like a super heavy matte. Like to me, it's like more of a demi natural looking matte. So this foundation is so amazing. I love this foundation. If you haven't tried this foundation out, please go out and try it. It's about eight to nine dollars. It's such a great foundation and I honestly recommend it to everybody and it's just amazing and since we're on to the skin stuff like the face stuff I'll show you guys like a translucent powder I've been loving for the month of December this is the Milani translucent medium to deep setting powder this powder is amazing you guys like honestly this I never would have thought to pick up to pick this powder up since I picked it up I have not been able to put this powder down. Like this powder is so amazing. I have, I don't have a lot of setting powders. I just use like translucent powders, but then now I start using more yellow tone powders because I feel like the translucent powder would make me look a little bit um, white. Like it, it would make me have like really bad flashback and I don't get any flashback with this. And this powder is so amazing and it's so affordable and it's just awesome and yeah you should definitely try to get this um, powder. Another thing I've been loving in December is this bronzer right here. This is the Bare Minerals Invisible Bronze Powder and this is in the shade Dark to Deep. I love this bronzer right here. Like it's such a nice bronzer especially for darker skin tones. Um, this bronzer is definitely more of a natural bronzer. It's called like invisible bronzer. I think it's more so like it's you're not gonna get like a chiseled look with this bronzer. You're gonna get more of like a natural bronzy like a like just like a natural like warmth to your skin. I actually have this bronzer on right now. Like I don't know if you notice that I have it on or if you don't notice, but this bronzer is really really nice. Um, I think it's. Just like an everyday bronzer. Like if you're just trying to bronze and go, like it's really, really good. Um, it definitely does add warmth to my skin and I definitely it's a little pricey. I do recommend it. I bought it I think for $28. I think it was $28. Yeah. It was $28, but I used my 20% off at Ulta um to purchase this bronzer. But this bronzer is so amazing. And now onto my last face thing. I have this spray right here. This is the Morphe Continuous Setting Spray. I'm actually almost out of this spray. I use this spray every single time I do my makeup. I have not been able to put this spray down. I love this spray so much. Um, I actually love it. I used to use the Milani Make It Last Setting Spray. I love this way, way, way more than it. Uh, I love how it's like a continuous mist. Like it's not like, like when you spray it, it's like a mist. It's not like, um, it doesn't squirt water, like the spray on your face. And I love that about it. And I just love how I just spray as much as I want. And when I'm using this, I never stop spraying it because it's just amazing. And it does like make my skin look very, um, nice. It just makes my foundation look very nice. I, I don't get really oily when I use this spray. I feel like my makeup just melts if I'm wearing highlight. Like my highlight just melts into my skin. So this setting spray is so great and this is actually I think it's like 15. It's for like my face stuff. I have a little bit like I have like two more makeup items to show you guys. So they're lip products. I have been loving the Jordana Sweet Cream Matte Lip Liquid Lip Color in the shade Cinnamon Toast. This is like a perfect nude for me. I have just been like, even on my days that I don't wear any makeup, I just literally put this on my lips and some mascara and I'm out the door. And this liquid lipstick is so beautiful. Like it's so natural and nice, but it just kind of just adds like a little, it has a tint of brown. And my favorite nudes to wear are pinky brownie nudes. I love like those types of nudes. So I just am in love with this shade. It's such a beautiful um, shade. And yeah, and Jordana lip products are very, very affordable. They're like, I think I bought this for $5 because I just love the shade. But the next week when I went back to Walgreens, um, they were on sale for like 250 
So like I was saying before, Walgreens has sales and if you buy like the products, if you buy the products like on sale, it's so much great. Like I went, it's so much better. I actually went back to Walgreens a couple weeks ago and I actually picked up three more of these. So another lip product that I've been loving in the month of December is this lip liner by ColourPop. This is Grunge Lip Liner. It's such a beautiful color. It's like a plummy, brownie, pinky, brownie shade. Um, like I was saying before, I love, 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 I love, love, love pinky brown nudes. So this lip liner is such a great staple for me like I always have this like in either my purse or somewhere handy for me so I can just grab it and go because I wear this lip liner almost every day especially on the days I go to work and I don't want to wear a lot of makeup so I just put this on and go. That was all for my makeup items so now I'm gonna move on to like hair products so for the month of December I have two hair products that I have been in love with. This is the Carol's Daughter Black Vanilla Moisture and Shine Hydrating Conditioner. My hair has been so dry lately. I mean, I have naturally like dry hair, so. But my hair has been so dry and this really, really does help my hair. It, it just makes my hair feel so soft and so hydrated and just very healthy. And my, my hair has been feeling very brittle lately and very like, not as bouncy as it used to be or not as like thick and heavy as it used to be so I just feel like this definitely restores that it has biotin it has shea butter it has pro vitamin b5 and I love shea butter that biotin is really good for your hair so this conditioner is amazing and it smells it smells really good it smells like like vanilla no that's why it's called black vanilla but um Carol's Daughter is such a great hair company. I think that this is my favorite line by her because she has like a red line, she has a green line, she has this one. And I've tried some stuff from the red line, but I feel like the red line, the stuff from the red line is not as, it doesn't, because I have thick, coarse hair. So I just feel like maybe if I had like thinner, finer hair, you know, maybe it would have worked better, better for me. But I feel like this line really does work for me. It's such a great product. And of course, I cannot live without my kinky, curly, not today. I love this stuff. As you can see, my bottle is like done, almost done. Um, Kinky curly is such a staple in every, natural should be such a staple in every natural girls collection. This stuff literally will detangle all the knots in your hair. If you don't have this, go out to Target. If you're natural, go out to Target and purchase this because honestly, I don't know what I would do without this. I really don't. Like my hair, before when it was time for me to detangle my hair, it would take me forever to detangle my hair. But with this, my detangling process is cut in half and it just like and when you wash your hair and you have this in your hair, your hair is so much softer. It really is. And this product is such an amazing product. Like, honestly, I really, 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 really recommend this to every single girl. Especially, especially if you have super coarse, kinky hair. Like, I have super coarse, dry, kinky hair. So this product really helps me to just really get in there and detail angle my hair without like nodding without breaking my hair in the process as well so this is such a great um product it's like about $13 but it's such a great investment and you can also leave it use it as a leave-in conditioner I tried it as a leave-in but I love it more as a detangler so this is such a great product I need to go out and buy like more of these because I cannot live without my kinky curl. The last product that I have is this right here. This is the e.l.f. Daily Face Cleanser and this is with purified water. So I have always thought that my cleanser, like before using this cleanser, I always thought my cleansers had to be like super harsh and super strong with like benzoyl peroxide and salicylic acid, especially because I have bumps in my face. But you know what I realized? I realized that, you know what, I probably should use a cleanser that is more pure and then use treatments like serums and, and toners and moisturizers and things like that and peels and exfoliators that have like salicylic acid in it. So this cleanser right here is so great. It's so gentle and that's what I love about it. It's such a gentle, gentle, super gentle cleanser and it's so affordable. It's $4. I got mine at Target for four bucks. But it's just the thing I love about this cleanser is that it's that it cleans my skin. 
it takes away my makeup if I'm wearing makeup it takes away every trace of makeup and it's so gentle like it you know that feeling like that super tight skin feeling that you might get after washing your face this does not give it to you at all and at first when I opened it I saw that it was like a gel like consistency but and I was kind of scared about that because my experience with gel like consistency cleansers is that they do make my face super dry but this cleanser does not make my face super dry at all and honestly ever since I've been using this cleanser like it has not break, broken me out it has not caused me to have more pimples this has not caused me to have more bumps or anything it's not gonna change your skin it's not gonna get rid of acne or anything some type of cleanser but it is a very good and gentle face cleanser that you can honestly use every single day and it just doesn't hurt your skin like I just love this cleanser it's such a good cleanser so that is it for my December favorites I really hope you guys enjoyed this video thank you so so much for watching again I am simply Christelle as you can see right here I have it on my little what is this called a uh, light box light box yeah so my name is simply Christelle and my ring light is making this so bright hold on Make it so bright, but I am Simply Crystal here on YouTube. I'm really excited to see what 2019 brings for all of us here on YouTube. If you're not subscribed to my channel, please subscribe. Comment anything positive down below. Please like this video as well. Give it a big thumbs up. And I will be seeing you guys in the next video. And again, happy, happy new year. And I'll be seeing you guys in my next video. Bye.